Like, I don't know. I just think motherfuckers don't know what they're talking about sometimes. If they're going to come to you and say, that's unprofessional. You're going to wait till the last minute to tell us when it's going down. I get an email about a about a job we doing a show or a movie or whatever. They tell you, we filming tomorrow. But they don't even tell you when. They don't tell you where. You get an email like 1 o'clock in the morning. Okay, call time at 9 a.m. Shit happen like this. Catch up or get left behind. <laughs> now... Just, uh, I'm just curious, how much, like, when you're starting actor or actress, how much you getting paid to do something? Shit, extras is the scum of the earth in Hollywood. We get nothing. <laughs> we, get, we get pennies. Background is just background. you like a chair or, you know what I'm saying, or a wall. You just background. They pay you basic, basic rates, man. It's like $8 an hour almost, you know what I'm saying, but it's something. But then if you can get up to a feature, you get bumped up. And if you get speaking roles, then you get bumped up for real. You got to crawl before you walk. Now, what about uh, when you're doing local, when you're trying to get to where you could get a speaking role? Hey, you're nah, trying to you, just get some experience. When you first coming out the gate, you're going to have to do everything you can. Student, student films, you don't get paid to do those. Any type of independent films, nine times out of ten, these people don't have no budget where they can pay everybody to be involved. If you want to get that IMDB credit, that's where you at. Basically, when you can get your name out there where people can see, oh, he did this, oh, he did that, she did this, she did that. Now you can go up to the point where now you can charge people. But coming out the gate, if don't nobody know you, who gonna pay to see you? Yeah, so basically they ain't getting no money. Ain't nobody getting no money in these independent films, all this stuff, man. I did so much stuff. I ain't doing it for the money. I'm doing it for the love and for the fame. You know what I mean? Then once I get my name to a certain degree, then I'll be able to say, okay, well, you know if I'm in it, people going to watch it. So you got to pay me to be in it. So the key is getting yourself to a point where you know where the person that you're dealing with know that if they put you in here, it's going to draw a certain amount of people to the product. Exactly. When you the commodity is when you get paid to be the commodity. Until then, you just another person in the production. Basically, you till then you reaping the benefits of the production. You ain't bringing no value besides to your little talent. Right, your you're talent. not pulling no people to the shit to make it make money. Right. I mean, if your name like Delicious, for instance, you know what I'm saying? Her name is popping. She out there. So when she you put her in your movie, obviously you pay her something. Because when they see her on that cover, that DVD, they gonna buy it even if they don't know nothing about it. But just like but five years ago or ten years ago, whatever, you put delicious in your movie, then nobody know who she was when nobody really cared. So until you are a commodity, you not a commodity. You just an actor, like a hundred million other actors, but you only know about fifty of them. And it's millions of them. But you gonna know me. <laughs> Alright now, that's it. Thank <laughs> you.